Andrew said at the top of the show, and producer Rob is pushing us on this. He wants some predictions for 2024. Who's going to win the Six Nations? The Champions Cup winners, Premiership top four, and overall winner, URC winner and player of the year. Bloody hell, producer Rob. He wants a lot, doesn't he? He Let's wants start a lot. off with, he wants it all. Six Nations, right? I'm going to say, for? really quickly, I'm going to say France. They play England at home. They play Ireland at home. Um, no DuPont, though. No DuPont, but I don't think there's too many others that are going to go from the World Cup. And, you know, there's a bit of pain there, isn't there? So I think France are in the best position. Scotland have got a sniff. One of the least affected teams post-World Cup. Jim, I'm saying you got a chance. Well, if you're oh. saying we've got a chance, we're fucked. If you're saying that. <laughs> I reckon France as well. I want Scotland to do well. I just think France, I think England are going to do well. Interesting how Ireland go. With no Sexton, no Mac Hansen. Yeah, England's first two games, Italy away, Wales at home. Oh, what are you saying? We could be two from two, lads. Hey, we'll come on to that. Can't wait for the Six Nations. So we're both going for France. Correct. Correct. Champions Cup winner, Jim, who are you going with? To lose. See, I said it quickly there. La Rochelle don't quite look the same, although I did see something on Big Willie Lee, Willie Little Willie, Big Willie, Willie Little, Little Willie Skelton. I saw him carving up again at the weekend. Yeah. The problem I'm for thinking. La Rochelle... The problem for La Rochelle is they've got, well, they play Leicester this weekend at home. They've lost their first two games. Uh, they've got to win both their games coming up to qualify uh, and hope things go their way. They're going to get an away last 16 game. So I, I, st- I still think La Rochelle are in the mix. The quality of player there, Botti is back, firing shots. Um, they, they you look could brilliant. probably call it after this weekend. That's going to be yeah. the one without stating the obvious. It's going to be after this weekend, but producer yeah. Rob wants blood now. So what are you going for? Uh, I'm going to go for. Uh, I'm going to say Toulouse or La Rochelle or Northampton. How about that one? Oh gosh, there you go. Hey, Let's just, get English uh, club in there just for the crack. Lee Radford. I'm just going. To, I'm going to say Toulouse. I've got a feeling Leinster. I don't know why they haven't been amazing, but I've just got a feeling that's a good thing for them. So I'm going to stick with Toulouse. There we go. Premiership top four overall winners. I normally smash this segment. Really. But it's so hard to call. It's a sprint. Yeah, what do you mean? Really? Yeah, genuinely. Yeah. <laughs> this is normally yeah. where I do really well. Top four is probably the hardest it's ever been, isn't it? In reality. Um, Should I go first? I reckon you Northampton go. win it. I reckon yeah. Northampton win it. I think it's going to be a Northampton S- Bath final. Oh. And I think Northampton take it. Who would, you want to win? Who, who would you want to win out of Northampton and Bath? It's kind of like... Mm. I'd say Northampton today because we had Lee Radford on, but I've got no association apart from smashing Sam Vesti's house to bits when we were younger <laughs> and when he lived in Loughborough. <laughs> I've never told you that's, hey, that's a story for another day. We used to... He basically wanted me and Kovskins to come around and smash his house up so he could do an insurance job. That's what he said. <laughs> <laughs> that's a true story. I'd have to go for Bath because Finn Russ was there. I'd... I'm not a massive Bath fan, even though I'm there at the weekend. But I like the way that they're playing. I, lo- I love on. you, and Van Graham. Hold on, we had Van Graham on the other week, and you were that, wha- waxing lyrical about him. What a yeah, great because I like and, him. I, yeah. yeah, that's why I like who they've got, like involved in the club. Andy Robinson's involved there as well, so I could warm to him. Might see him at the weekend. Finn Russell's there. Cam Redpath. I thought you hated Andy Robinson. I, I thought you hated Andy Robinson. I do. I'm just saying, like, as in, <laughs> if he starts winning, I might be convinced. I'm going to say Bath. All right, let's go for it. As in, Premiership top four, let's nail it down. Shall I go first? You go first, Jim. I'm going to go Northampton, Bath, Leicester. Yes. Oh, can I... I Sale. I don't know if Saracens make it. I can't believe I just wow. said it. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Uh, just I'm been go... so up and down this year. Sorry, yeah. go on, you go. I don't want to explain. I've left it there. And then out and out winner, I'm going to say Northampton. Yeah. I'm going to go top four of Saints, Leicester, Saracens, and Bath. Uh, oh, I've left Sale out of the top four. Um, Mate, you're done now. Swap... That's it. That's, no, you can't swap in. Like, you've gone with your heart and your head in yeah. one. Yeah. There you go. URC, I can't even work out the permutations, even though I commentate on them. Okay, so it's top bet, four. Benetton a second. Benetton a second. I know they are. There's a big old break, though. There's a big old break to recalibrate the minds and the, the bodies. Ulster had a big win. 
in Leinster, didn't they? Over yeah, oh, New, New Year's Day, I think it was. Yeah, pushing it done. Um, yeah. Munster, they they've got nineteen injuries. So Winsbury, many injuries. Yeah, Graham Roundtree, just keep your head under the <laughs> covers, mate. For now, Nine, I think it's nineteen <laughs> injuries they've got. I saw Gavin Mental. Coombs went off as well with a nasty injury as well at the weekend. Right, let's go URC. So it's race to eight. <laughs> Sounds better. So race to the top eight. And Benetton a second, like you said, mate. They are. They're doing very well this year. Very I'd well. I'd be very indeed. surprised if they won it. Right, we're going to nail it down. I think Leinster win it because Munster are current champions, got loads of injuries, nowhere near it. I'd love to say the Drags. I know they got a win against the Scarlets. Actually, quite good. Quite enjoyed the game. I was yeah. 13 12, wasn't it? It was. I've, I've, got, I've got a new name for the Scarlets as well. What? Well, so we call the dragons the dregs or the drags, and we're going to call them scarlets because they are so shit. The scats. Is that all right? Is <laughs> that's that like, no, it's no. <laughs> too, that's too horrible. Much. <laughs> too much. I love Dwayne Peel back. It's tough for the Welsh regions. Out and out winner, I'm going to go Leinster. They're going to be pissed off getting beat by Ulster at home. Yeah. And yeah. that's going to be the catalyst for them to win the URC. They're top of the log, albeit by two points at the minute. You're not going Glasgow or Edinburgh. They're going all right. Glasgow going well. Edinburgh, yeah. uh, they're all right. Yeah, they're they're all right. Uh, the, yeah, Edinburgh, what, what, they're all right. One six, lost three. They're doing all right. Yeah, they're all right. They're all right. They're not. They're not quite where they need to be to win, Andrew. And you know it. You just okay. taking the push. Yeah. Yes. 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 Okay. I'm going to go a final of the Stormers against Leinster. I'm going to say it. I'm. Gonna, I'm going to say it. Leinster are going to lose again. Stormers are going to win it. Stormers to win the URC this year. I'm going to go a bit rogue. I'm going to go Leinster, Ulster final. Oh, yes. And Leinster win it. Leinster win it. That would be a belter. Pod, 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 pod. Rugby pod.